Palm size artwork from the Orange River General Region, Northern Cape of South Africa. Now this specimen has been sawn to stand flat like this. So I'll take you around as it would stand. Cross like that. Cross like that. Cross like that. To me the main point of display would be an angle like this. Maybe tilting it over. And what you see here is this lovely phantom... Uh, uh, basically multiple generational growth of the quartz so an original quartz crystal which uh, had some iron oxides or hematite specular hematite in this case growing on it which oxidized lost some of its oxygen and turned red as a result often yellow and reds and then a secondary silica flow came over it you see the the second generation of quartz trapping the original um, uh, 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 formation within which gives us these lovely phantoms. All the way from the uh, Orange River, General Orange River region, Northern Cape of South Africa. I think I struggled a little bit with the still pictures on this one, so I, I ended up focusing on one angle, which I just showed you. A little bit of amethyst here as well, so let's look at that sideways view. Let's look at the view in like this. Ah, oh, look at that. Quite, quite amazing, these phantoms. It's like little eyes from within. Remember the alien eye fluorites from Namibia? Similar, these little red phantoms inside the quartzes.